At least these hills aren't steep. What animal is that one? I reckon. I reckon it's a. Uh, yeah, it could be. Could be a wild pig. Let's have a look. Das Rottweiled. Wild? Das Rottweiled. The Steinalder. That's for taking children. It's for taking deer. Deer? Yeah. Oh dear. Can. <laughs> <laughs> So I guess it's probably a good time to come here because you can actually get places. If it's really bad snow, then, Hi. Hi. then all these places are going to be very difficult. What's that? Das Gamswald. Gamswald. Das Gamswald. Das Gamswald. That's in Scottish, doesn't it? Oh, is it? Yeah. Well, maybe they're Scottish. Gamswald. <laughs> Come on, Amika, let's go. For the, let's just go have a look at the waterfall. It's only up the road. No, it isn't. It's like a million miles away. <laughs> That's the track we just walked up. So you can see the elevation. Liet Kamaklam, 10 minutes. I thought that's where we just. Well, that's where we were going. Yeah. Oh, here comes some skits. What's no. Okay. Hello. Huge shame we didn't have a sledge with us because this is basically a sledge run. Yeah, for skiing, I guess, but yeah. We have a sledge. It's no wonder so many people like came in and have left because they've walked all the way up and then shot back down again. Yeah. Didn't they? Yeah. Roller coaster! Roller coaster time. It's a snowy roller coaster. I just noticed there's lights here on the trees. Oh, yes. So, cool. so this is lit up at night time so people can ski down it. How cool is that? You've got snow in your jacket, which has been there for ages and it's not melting because it's so cold. Yep. Bye-bye! <laughs> <laughs> that hurt, that did. That really hurt. Hope I haven't hurt my back again. There you go. Oh, there's somebody coming down on skis now. They might have to actually take their skis off, you see. Hello. You speak English? Yeah. How high do you go up? Um, the peak was 3,250. Wow. So, and yeah, you, it's you, a long... You climb all the way up? Yeah, How long this morning. Uh, it took us four hours. Wow, wow. It's like 1,800 altitude meters. Yeah, wow. Excellent. Yeah, it's super good. <laughs> One of the best mountains you can you can ski in springtime. Is it really? Yeah. Excellent, cool. It's so good. We'll have to try it. We 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 only tried skiing for the first time yesterday, so. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then you might want to learn something before you. Yeah. You hop on that one. Yeah, I think so. Quite a long one. Yeah. Where are you from? Uh, England. Ah, oh, nice. Yeah. Cool. Come for some winter, oh, uh, spring snow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now it's perfect. Yeah, it's good. Excellent, have a good uh, journey down. There he goes. Whoa, cool. 
Very cool. Hello. So as you know, I like to do things that are different. So we randomly came to this place just because I knew that we could park here, no problem. And fall over. Yeah. Now after chatting to that guy on the snowboard and after going skiing yesterday and saying that we would like to go snowboarding and he said just then that this is one of the best places to get some, did he say spring snow? Yeah. So, I'm going to learn how to snowboard. And so am I. I'm going to get some winter stuff. So am I. So she, so she. <laughs> and then, we're going to come here, early doors, climb up the mountain for four hours. Oh, great. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> yeah. I'll have to get some practice in. Oops, nearly fell over again. And Wait. then, we're going to come and snowboard down this mountain. There we go, back at the bottom. Would you like some... Rainwater? No, I'm alright for rainwater, sir. Like I said, it's all, although that, that one seems to be broken, it's all lit up at night time, so I guess you can come down here in the dark, which would be absolutely epic. I suppose all this stuff's pretty normal around it. We're just not used to it. Gespert. Danger of, not danger of a mountain, danger of an avalanche. Right then, let's make our way back to the car. Van! And then go to, oh yeah, back to the van. And then where are we going? See my mummy! I'd rather, I'd rather drive four hours to see my mum than, than climb up a mountain for four billion, billion, billion hours. Okay, <laughs> cool. Right then, let's keep going this way. Jump off, you ready? No! No, I'm not. <laughs> Good dad. I'm going to jump off this one then. No! <laughs> I'm going to go up there now. Are you going to do the same? Yes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Very crazy. What an incredible last night place to park. Not had the hand of tickle for a while. No. <laughs> <laughs> and there's the van. In the busy car park.
So we absolutely killed it with the air fryer and all that sort of stuff. What we now need to do is recharge the power station back up. It's only on 30% lower than what it was. Um, but just looking at what we're getting here, we can pick it up on the camera. So we're currently getting nearly 300 watts of solar and we're on 94%. We've got a four hour journey and we'll now dump power from the Bluetti into the all power station. So that will only take 14, 1.4 kilowatts and it's a 1.5 kilowatt unit. So it should only take 10 minutes or so and that'll be fully charged. But yeah, that won't take long to do. So we'll make sure that we've got a double, double espresso, double, double to keep us going. That should smash us for the next four hours. We'll wait for that unit to get charged up and then we'll be on our way. So yesterday, obviously we went skiing and we forgot to tell you what it was like. Mm, it's very scary and fun. Yeah, we went on the wrong one, didn't we? So, but still we had a great time yeah. and we both really, really enjoyed it that much that we're going to go back and do it again, aren't we? Yeah, you might even get some snowboards. Yeah. Did you enjoy that skiing though? Yeah. Did you see? Did you see that um, sled with? Yeah. Tell me. With the wood, it was so. Cool. Oh, the wooden sledges, traditional sledges, yeah. <laughs> Super cool, isn't it? Yeah. Cool. Right then, let's get to Germany. Stop quickly turn the van around just to get a few photographs. But yeah, pretty special, pretty, pretty good view all the way across the other side of the dam. That is absolutely magical. What do you think of the view? stop to empty all of the rubbish out of the van into that bin. Plenty of bins there, so I haven't filled it up, don't worry. You all right? Yep. Yep. One and a half hours till you see your mum. Yeah. Excited? Yeah. yeah. At least someone is. Right. Let's carry on. Is that everything in? Yeah. Should Wash. No, no, ignore. Card on. Go. It's all right, nobody can see. Press the start button. 15 degrees, keep going. Press it again. 52, 51, 39, 40. Uh, yeah, do it on that one, that's fine. Press the green button. Done. That's locked. Ooh, hello. Anybody in there? 27 minutes. I would have done it for 40 degrees, but it's an hour. So we're not waiting an hour. Right, let's go and get some food. Yeah. How long? 40 minutes. She's setting the timer. 
All set? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so this car that's next to us um, has just pulled up and a lady has gone into the bins and taken out all of the, all of the bottles, um, put them into their car. It's obviously in Germany. You get refund, don't you? You get a little bit of money back, but she's obviously just driving around collecting glass bottles. Right, we've got about how many minutes we've got left now until the drone's done? It's not going to be done though, it never dries clothes properly. Hello! Wakey wakey, 11 minutes 40 seconds. 11 minutes. Then we're going to see mum. Yeah. Every time you laugh, your face goes from <laughs> red to white when it squashes. You stop laughing, it goes red again. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. This place is absolutely rammed. It must be cheap for lorries to park here. You do have to pay, I think it's four euros a night though, so. Two minutes left. Hi. What are you? She's always eating. You're always eating sweets. Worst oh. case scenario, I'll have to come back in the morning. Do we get you to like a play centre or something like that, couldn't we? Yeah. <laughs> The offers are still there, by the way, guys. If anybody wants to buy it, or you know. Love it to scam. One minute left. Right, and this must be done now. Where's the bag? Here. There's no more I could accidentally. You are weird. <laughs> Excited. So this is a place where loads of people ended up getting when they got evacuated out of the Ukraine. This obviously used to be some sort of pub with, with rooms, but now it's just got basically refugees in it. And Amika's mum managed to get a place here. <laughs> Yeah, I suppose it's better than going back to Belarus where she was from. Here she is.